Hello guys, it's Dave back with another video. So today we are doing another, sorry, robotics video, yay. So today we are doing this map and my challenge is to make a program using only loops and my blocks. So you might be wondering, hey, what's a my block? So basically a my block is like a mini, uh, a mini program in a block. So, so for guy or left turn, which is this my block, these are my my blocks. So yeah, I have five of them. Guy or left turn, which is this program smushed into one block. And you might be wondering, Ing, uh, what are these? Because usually in my blocks, they don't have these parameters settings. Well, these are actually parameters. They let you control well, they let you change things inside the program without having to make another my block. So it makes it really convenient. And the purpose of a my block is just to make the program like a little tinier so that it's not sprawling and big. Yeah. So that is a my block. So you might, might be wondering, hey, how do you make a my block? So this is how you make it. So you select. All of, oh, oh, no. You select all of your, uh, you select everything in your program. So there, selected it. Then you go to tools. Press that. And then there's going to be something called a My Block Builder. You press that, obviously. And then you can choose how many parameters there are, and you could choose the icon. So what I did, I choose. I made two parameters and chose speed and degrees. And then I made a separate like icons for that. And that is how you make a my blog. Well, you also need to have a program. Yeah. So, so now I'm going to explain my program, which is basically uh, just basically three, three, uh, three my blocks because I created these two after. And also these two, these three are better. So, so first we're gonna have a loop for wait for the wall and gyro left turn. Wait for the wall is a program that uses the ultrasonic sensor to go all the way until 10 centimeters before the wall, and then, and then, in the program I use a gyro left turn. A gyro left turn then is the my block that just makes a left turn using a gyro. So yeah. Those are the two my blocks here. Then we go over to the second loop. Uh, oh, also the first loop gets us all the way over here. And then the second loop gets us all the way to the red square. Goes like boop, 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 turn, boop, turn, boop, turn, boop, turn, boop, yay. So basically a guy with right turn it's really self-explanatory. I don't know why I'm explaining this to you, but I still am. A gyro right turn is a right turn using the gyro sensor. And so that is my program. So let's get started. Let's go. Stop right there. You have encountered a water checkpoint. Get up from that seat of yours if you're watching this video and go drink some water. Let's drink. Ooh, empty. This time it was actually empty, yes. So, now that you drink water, let's get back to the video. Let's go. Okay. So now, after that really long water break that I probably did in the future, I present to you Program 3, May Solver Expert. And let's do this. Yay. Okay. And the robot starts moving. So as you can see in the in the loop, this is uh this is all happening in the first loop until it gets over here. I'm big, I think. 
also the reason why I used a gyro sensor in all of these programs is so that it can have more accurate turns. So that is the first one. No, no, no. And that is the second loop now. Yay. Halfway there, whoa, whoa, whoa. leaving on a program. You got this. My parents are so confused right now because they think I'm talking to someone. Who would I talk to? I'm an introvert. Come on. Yes, yes. Yes, 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 we did it, let's go, Woo yay, so yeah, that is my program to solve the May Solver expert, I guess I'm an expert at May Solving now, so yeah, that's the end of the video, wait, no, it's not. I have one piece of information to tell you. The MyBlocks actually can't be put out of another project. So this one tab is my expert, expert made solver program, myblock.ev3. That's my project. But if I go to another project, see, it says project, the MyBlocks won't be there. The MyBlocks you create will only be in the project project that you use them for. So yeah, that's all the information about my blog and how I completed this. That. No wait. Up there. Don't don't mind the don't mind the project. That the program. And yeah, that's how I solved it. So that's the end of the video guys. Please like and subscribe if you want to see more of this. And also comment down below what you want to see next. So, so yeah, that's it. Goodbye.